On October 18, 1989, in West Branch, Iowa, Gerald Ford, the 38th President of the United States, shared history with students from across Iowa. The visit was part of a conference on the role of former presidents in American society, sponsored by the Herbert Hoover Library and Museum and the Gerald Ford Library and Museum. Here's how these students took advantage of a rare learning opportunity. Thank you very, very much. It's a very high honor and a very great privilege for me to come to West Branch and to participate in this conference, which is being held here at the Hoover facilities. Mr. Ford, what advice would you give a young lady wanting to become President of the United States? <laughs> well, I hope we do have a young lady at some point become President of the United States. Uh, I can tell you how I think it will happen because it won't happen in the uh, normal course of events. Either the Republican or Democrat political party will nominate a man for president and a woman for vice president. And the woman and man will win. So you'll end up with a, a president, a male, and a vice president, a female. And in that term of office of the president, the president will die. And the woman will become president under the law or constitution. And once that barrier is broken, from then on, men better be careful because they'll have a hard, hard time ever even getting a nomination in the future. But that's the way it's going to happen, and I uh, think it'll probably come sometime in the next uh, four or eight years.